Hey there, folks. Hope you're doing well today. Wanted to come with a pretty interesting news article. This is from Fox News, uh, titled Harris Trump Showdown. New poll indicates who has edge in battle for crucial electoral vote. Not necessarily good news, and it's very surprising seeing it come in from Fox News. Let's dive right in. A new poll in the race for crucial electoral votes that could potentially determine whether Madam President Harris or former President Trump win the 2024 White House race suggests that Madam President Harris holds a sizable lead. Harris stands at 53% support and Donald Trump at 42% among likely voters in Nebraska's second con uh, congressional district, according to a new CNN poll conducted September 20th to the 25th that was released on Friday. Nebraska and Maine are the only two states in the nation that divide their electoral votes by congressional district. A competitive district in each state could help decide whether Harris or Trump succeeds the President Biden in the White House. Nebraska is solidly red in presidential elections. Trump carried the state by 25 points in 2016 to his White House victory uh, by 19 points in 2020 in his re-election defeat. But Nebraska's second district, an urban suburban area anchored by the city of Omaha, has a history of being competitive. Uh, in 2008, then Democratic presidential nominee Barack Obama narrowly won the district by capturing its single electoral vote in 2012. GOP Mitt Romney won the district by single digits. Trump narrowly carried the district in 2016, but Biden won it four years later. The poll indicates Harris grabbing the support of 96% Democrats, 61% of independents, and even 10% support among Republicans. Just grabbing it there. I love it. According to the survey, Harris holds a 24-point lead among female voters, while Trump's advantage among men is just five points. Six in 10 of those questioned in the CNN poll said that Nebraska should keep its current system of rewarding electoral votes in a presidential election, with 40% of it saying it should switch to the system employed in 48 states where the statewide winner grabs all the electoral votes. Trump and the National Republicans made a full court press in the recent weeks to urge Nebraska Republican lawmakers to change the law and switch to a winner-take-all system, but their lobbying effort fell short. Well, very interesting article. Uh, it's so interesting to see Fox News citing CNN uh, and then writing this kind of story that it really puts Trump in a bad light in like a state that he should be just dominating. And uh, maybe it's cracks in the dam, folks, cracks in the dam. We know what we got to get out there and do, folks. We got to get out there and vote blue. Let's do it. Dark Brandon.